This video will, pre will present electrophilic addition on a conjugated diene. On this specific conjugated diene, there are two double bonds. Reaction can operate differently. We're going to be looking at the protonation of the green double bond. Initial step, protonation, double bond electron rich will react with the proton electron poor to give two possible intermediate. One intermediate Second intermediate, not showing the detailed architecture, carbon architecture stays the same. Double bond here is not effective, not keeping the purple color. And what we have is addition of the hydrogen at that position or this position, resulting in two different carbocation, both secondary. But beside the fact that they're both secondary, one is more stable than the other. Which one? The carbocation right here, being adjacent to the double bond, is referred to as an allylic carbocation. Whereas this one here is too far to resonate or to allow resonance form conjugation with the additional double bond, is therefore not allylic. Being not allylic and this one being allylic, we have the resonance form on the right here, the secondary allylic carbocation being more favor than the other one. So that means that we don't have formation of this intermediate, or if its form is formed in minor amount, negligible. So we can continue the mechanism with the secondary allylic carbocation being more stable than the secondary, not allylic carbocation. Okay. Because it's secondary and it's allylic, there is possibility of resonance. That is the way to show that. With this set of arrow here, with two ads on the same line, indicating delocalization of electron, and indicating that we're not writing a different intermediate, we're writing a different representation of that intermediate. So let's do this. So once again, the carbon architecture stays the same. The double bond is moving right there. And we now have the positive charge at this position. So this is the intermediate form, which is more stable than the unfavored intermediate. In the next step, we can draw the bromine, more specifically the bromide with a negative charge. And that bromide can react with the carbocation, so we can have addition of the bromide on the carbocation. The two are possible, giving the two product derived from these two resonance form. So one like this. So both products will have the same carbon architecture. In this case, the double bond remains there. And we have bromine at this position. In the other case, the double bond stays at the same position, and we have the bromine adding on the carbocation. For the purpose of further discussion, it's important to indicate that the reaction here are reversible. We're going to see that this influence which product is formed. In that particular case, because of the relative positioning of the double bond, the two products are identical. That is a coincidence due to the nature of the starting material. That will not always be the case, so that's why it's important to look at the bromination of the two resonance form for this intermediate.